Hey y'all, sorry. I just wanted to say, um, I am so sorry for the way that I am looking in this video. I don't know why, but I thought I was looking cute with my, with my hair clips in my hair like that. But no. <laughs> so yeah, I'm sorry about that. But just ignore it, okay? Um, you know, I'm gonna tell you guys a story. So, stay tuned. <laughs> welcome back to my channel so if you're new to my channel like and comment you know down below and so today we'll be doing a story time so this story time is crazy just kidding it is crazy but it's not like oh my god but um okay so it all started a long time ago years ago years ago okay <laughs> Okay, so, you know, when I was little, like, everyone at school had their ears pierced, right? So, they all had their ears pierced. So, they all had their ears pierced, and I didn't. So, I would wear, like, clip-on earrings, okay? that That's embarrassing, all right? So, that was my life for a while. So, then for my eighth birthday, my eighth, my eighth birthday was coming up, right? Like, a week or in a couple days so I begged my parents I was like for my birthday can I get my ears pierced can I get my ears pierced so eventually they they gave in they're like all right all right okay you can get your ears pierced so we go we went to Claire's if y'all know what Claire's is then you know so we went to Claire's and we asked them hey can I get my ears pierced they're like yeah cool you know and I had to pick out which earrings that I wanted so they did right and, you know, I was nervous. So they gave me a, a little teddy bear to squeeze on, right? So I was squeezing my teddy bear. The lady did it. And then, um... So then, yeah, sorry. <laughs> so then she did my ears. So I was so happy. I was excited. I was like, yes. Oh. So she gave me all this stuff to, like, clean my ears, my earlobe and stuff. So she gave me all that. And then my parents... You know, my mom was like, you need to be responsible for that, blah, 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 blah. I'm freaking eight years old. You think I care? I was not listening. I was like, yeah, whatever. Okay, like, I'm eight. <laughs> I just want to go outside, play tag, play manhunt, and yeah. So, I wasn't even thinking about it. So, my mom got me, um, I guess my, um, my earlobe wasn't healed all the way yet. So, but we took out my earrings we took it out then we put my mom got me these um what's his name woody woody from store um toy story woody she got these earrings of him they were so cool so i put them on right and i have like fat earlobes all right look at that so i put them on i left them in for like forever and then one day my sister was like no, well, my mom was like, hey, like, you know, where's your, where's your earring? And I'm like, what do you mean, where's my earring? She, she was like, did you ever take it out? I was like, no, this, this should be on here. I was like, don't you see it? And, like, my earring was getting sucked into my earlobe, literally. And I was like, don't you see it? And I will never forget this. My sister, my, she's, I'm the youngest, so all my siblings are older than me. So my sister, Alex, she came. I just remember sitting on the bed. She told me to sit on the bed. She tried to take it out because the back piece of my earring was in my ear also. So she took out my the big earring part, right? But the back piece was inside my ear. Literally inside my ear. Both of them. So she couldn't get it out with her fingers. So she grabbed a hoop earring. A thick hoop earring. And just imagine a hoop earring. Like, come on. A hoop earring. Hold up. I'm about to get some, I'm about to get a hoop earring. So the hoop earring, look, so this is a hoop earring, right? The hoop earring was way thicker than this, alright? This is back in the two thousands, like like two thousand I can't count. Whatever. So this is it, alright? She just she shoves it in my ear and you know. I was screaming at the top of my lungs. 
I have never felt pain like that in my life. So, she shoved it in my ear. She took the back piece out. All right, she took it out, still screaming. The next ear. Oh my God. My right ear. She had to do the same thing. She shoved that thick hoop earring in my ear. And she took it out. And it felt like forever. Oh my God. I will never forget that. I was like traumatized for like the rest of my life basically. I was so traumatized. I was like so like devastated. So yeah, that happened. And basically, long story short, don't get earrings if you can't take care of them. And always check your ears just in case they get inside your earlobe, all right? Because that is very painful. You do not want to go through that. It was just horrible. No. But I actually got my ears pierced last year in February. Yeah, in February. It'll be almost a year. Or, or in the or during the end of January. I'm not exactly sure. But yeah, I got my ears pierced. So like they're all good now. I can wear earrings. I take care of my ears. So yeah. So yeah, that's my story. And yeah, I will never forget that. That's a story I will always tell my friends. Like, hey, you know, blah blah blah, this happened. And they're like, no way, that's crazy. So yeah. That happened when I was eight and yeah anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this um story time <laughs> it's not recent but it's a good it's a good story all right it's a good story so anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video like and subscribe I'd really appreciate it and yeah thank you for watching